Hello and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. Today we're going to talk about XRP and how all 1 billion escrow was actually returned to escrow this month. Now, there is a bit of a misconception that they've never done this before because they have done this before. They actually did it in October. Um, they basically return 1 billion escrow. That means they can actually return the escrow they haven't returned before back into escrow, but that doesn't mean they actually haven't sold any XRP on the OTC market. It does, however, it does imply that they've really, really shrunken down then on the amount they sell. Now, Ripple itself, the company, not the founders, the company itself still owns about 6 billion XRP, not in escrow, so they can still sell those. The only way we can really tell if anything's actually come out is really by looking at the circulating supply. CMC is not always great at updating those, but since the last time I checked, it has increased to about 200 million over the last two months or so. So they still could be selling like 100 million out um, XRP um, OTC wise, but it looks like they've really clamped down on the OTC sales, telling the FIs to get it from normal exchanges. Depending on which side of the pendulum you're on, you're either saying that they're actually following through and uh, clamping down on the amount they're actually selling OTC, or you can say that FIs just really aren't that interested and no one's willing to buy at um, at a market price or no one's willing to buy unless they offer below market price and they're not willing to do that anymore. So you can say like there's really no there's really no demand or you can say that you know they're just going through with what they're saying and clamping down on the OTC sales. This hasn't really had much of an effect like the decreased escrow sales really hasn't had much of an effect on the price. Um, lately, it's 22 cents. It's come down just uh, with Bitcoin, and the Bitcoin ratio is slowly coming down. Um, started slowing, slowly coming down at swell, and it's continuing to come down uh, in terms of Bitcoin ratio. Fiat value ratio, it's basically decreased with the rest of everything else, and I'm still patiently waiting to buy back into XRP when it drops even further because I actually do believe it will. Now, there's plenty of articles saying 17 cents, even 8 cents or 3 cents or something. I don't know, like when I actually, I'll just buy in when I actually feel comfortable, but I think it'll be at least another two, um, one or two months before I feel comfortable, unless that is, it has a sudden drop, which for all cryptos is actually possible. But just wanted to make sure that people knew that they have actually returned a billion in escrow before, and they did it in October last time. Um, you can check the ledger for that. They actually did it in October last time, and this isn't really like the first time they've done something. Last time they did it, I mean, outside of the swell pump, it really didn't have much effect on price at all, and it actually has come down after swell, as people have actually seen. So um, essentially, they could still sell some XRP, but them returning a billion to escrow basically just means they're not selling a large amount of XRP anymore, OTC, and hopefully that helps the price, but some will see it as a decrease in overall demand. So that is the news for today. Let me know what you think, like and subscribe, and hit that bell notifications button. Thank you, and have a nice day.